yeah, buddy. We're out here. We're about to be in a storm, okay? Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Got my brother Zane. I don't want to be here. He don't want to be here, clearly, but he got to have to have a job or he's broke or completely poor. Well, there's is actually a difference between broke and poor. See, poor is when you have no house, no money, no nothing. Broke is when you're just straight up, well, hey, you just don't have anything in your life. Uh, well, well, you have a little bit of money, but you don't have a lot. <sighs> but, uh, yeah, we're about to be catching a storm on camera right now. Well, obviously, it's not going to get interesting until 1 o'clock in the morning. And I know I suck at this country accent. Well, it, uh, tell me if it's cut good in the comments. Y'all saw that. Y'all instantly saw my face. That means it was lightning. <laughs> Just a close shot of my face. It's ugly. Uh, uh, I tripped on a freaking log. Shut up. Hurry, 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 hurry. I'm a country boy. At a country house in a country country. In a in a country neighborhood in a country again a country country <laughs> in a country and have a country life a country country life I love being a country oh yeah I make country music albums that suck but still download them what one time I went one time I went to go jump out of a plane. But they didn't give me a parachute for some reason. I mean, they, they, for some reason they gave us me a parachute, but I didn't want one. Yeah. I, well, that's, that, that well, 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 that's, that's what you hear there, folks. Oh, mm -hmm. uh, I forgot what he said, but because I'm so dang stupid. But anyways. Hey, J hey, Jay, uh, hey. Yo. One time I was on a boat and we were fishing. Oh, no, I don't say no. yo anymore. Listen, I'm not shut freaking. Up, shut up. I say howdy, howdy. One time I was, we were, we were on a boat. We were looking for sharks. And on a boat looking for sharks. Yeah, we were looking for sharks, right? Yeah, right, and right. I was oh, you know, I was, I was getting sad because we never could find any. You know, I was getting sad. I was getting sad? Yeah. Because I wanted a shark. Because you didn't want her, you wanted a shark? But then finally I was happy for a second because I saw a shark. But then you I, saw a shark, but yeah. you didn't catch it? But then I was sad again because when I jumped in, it didn't eat me. Now that's just suicidal, but anyways. <laughs> <I'm> a, oh. <laughs> Contra people eat a lot of beans, y'all. <laughs> on God, man. A lot of beans. Oh, wait, no, I can't put stuff on God because yeah, I'm country well, country, people, country people do eat beans, probably. Yeah, we eat a lot of beans and strain beans and and uh, mashed potatoes and... <laughs> wait. And we drink a lot of beer. And sperm. And beer. You got a beer? I farted. He's saying you got a beer? No. You don't got a beer. All right. No. You don't got a beer, y'all. I suck at this accent, but that's just the way I was born. And I really, 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 really want to freaking get a box cutter. And cut through my face like a box. Okay? Oh no. We don't use box cutters around here. We use saws. Two people saws at some points as well. Where you have to pull. And then the next person pulls. And then the next person pulls. But anyways, let's get back to the weather. Uh, so it's uh, it's a little bit gloomy. Uh, it stopped lightning as you can see. And uh, it, it's going to start getting bad around... 1 a.m. So, uh, we're just gonna we're just gonna make a part two of this, but let's just keep make this the rest of this a vlog, all right? So yeah, a vlog, not uh, you know, a, a normal people they call it a vlog or or something like that, but we call it a vlog. Kind of sounds like dog, but with an L and a V in it and an O and a G. Well, with a v take away the D O. Well, take away the D, add a V, L, and then keep the G, and keep the O and the G, and then, then you got vlog, okay? You got a vlog. 
country people do vl not vlogs, but vlogs. Vlogs. No, sometimes even blogs. Vlogs. They call them blogs or vlogs. Vlogs. Blogs, all right. Blogs. Blogs. I'm a country redneck. Go around and go hunting. Sometimes it's up to what I'm feeling like. Sometimes I like to beat my meat. And I know a lot of other people, non countries, uh, do that. Like classic Americans. You no, know, all Americans. But uh, it's not tradition. It's mostly country people created jack and all. So if y'all want to, you want to hear a fucked up joke? How come okay, you listen, ain't country? Listen, listen, you ain't my brother. Okay, listen. You want to hear a messed up joke? Why are you all of a sudden? Okay, just tell me the joke. I want fuck. Um, Stop I'll, turning the light listen, on. Listen. It's blinding me. <laughs> a woman visits the doctor as she is, has abdominal pains and suspects she may be pregnant. After examination, Nominal pines. After examination, the doctor comes out to see her. Well, I hope you like changing nappies and diapers. She says, "Oh my God, am I pregnant?" To which, to which he responds, "No, you got bowel cancer." You got bowel cancer. You That's a it? funny joke, you, man. Ha ha ha. You get it? Because she's not gonna change diapers for a baby. She's gonna change diapers for herself because she has bowel cancer. She won't be able to hold it in. Her asshole's gonna be exploding shit. <laughs> oh, and yeah. uh, yeah, um, you're not my brother no more. You don't have the same accent as me. Yeah, boy. I love. Oh yeah, and also that rumor. Where country people fuck their own sisters. You got that all wrong, alright? Country people. I know a lot of country people in my day. And they do not do the dirty with their own sisters, alright? We do it with our wives, alright? Alright? Alright. Now, stop spreading rumors about country people. Talking about they do the dirty with the sisters. They don't do dirty with sisters. They don't do dirty with nobody. Until they get a wife. Which most likely, a lot of us have a lot of wives. But, I love. And then, they spread rumors about us being racist and all that stuff. But we love black people. We're not racist. But as we was telling y'all here, we're news reporters. We're in the rain right now. Well, hey, 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 Jay, you hear what's the beginning hey, of the storm? Jay, Jay, you hear a messed up joke, kind of. Hey, why what's wrong with your listen, accent? That's what why, I want to know. Listen, listen. Why, why can't orphans play baseball? Why? Because they don't know where home is. That's messed up. You don't get it, dude. Yeah, because orphans are like people that can be adopted, but they don't get homes. I get it. You get it? Baseball. Yeah. Stop telling messed up jokes. That's messed up right there. I would adopt a child right now, but I feel like I'm too young. Hey, hey you want another fucked up joke? It kind of don't make sense, but kind of makes sense. Don't tell me anymore. What's worse than find, jokes. What's worse than finding a worm in your apple? Finding a worm in your butthole. No, no. Finding I did that before. Okay, I'll just go to the next question. No, uh, no, no, no. Answer the question. No, What's the question, bro? No, it was a good question. I don't like that one. Tell me. No, it wasn't going. You wouldn't even understand that. I swear to God. I, well, I swear on my mommy. If you don't tell me that joke. Well, it's not a joke, but it's like a question or whatever. Whatever it was called. Like, how does that happen? Then just tell me the joke, man. Please, I need to know why whatever you said. I don't know what, I don't remember what it was, but I remember I really wanted you to tell me. Hey, you want to hear I don't a fucked up a, joke? I don't want to hear a fucked why up joke. Why do orphans like playing tennis? Oh my God. Because it's the only love they get. That's messed up, man. You get it? That's messed up. You get it? Like love tennis, you know, yeah. and then like love, like love from a father 
adopted mother or or something yeah I get it that's I get funny. a lot of these jokes but that's kind of messed up a lot well not even kind of like really 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 messed up really and I mean really messed up like really messed up all right don't tell any more of those jokes all right you want to hear another joke no I don't because I have a heart too you know I, 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 people say that country people heartless, but actually, that that's kind of true, but I'm actually, I have a heart. I don't got a heart of steel. I have a heart, like a, like a heart heart. You know what I'm saying? I got a heart heart. A hearty heart heart. Oh my God. The wind's blowing like a motherfucker. Oh my God. I cannot believe what we're seeing here. I sound like JR, but I'm not. I'm a countryest dude, whoever can be country. The most country of the countries, man. You know what I'm saying? Country, country, man. Man. Literally, I could like freaking eat a nice hot dog right now. Some wieners. Mm -mm -mm. That'll make my day. Maybe some, maybe like I said a little bit earlier, some beans. And fart up my face. I mean, ah. Uh, well, sorry, I, I, I kind of got a fish. But, ah, uh, yeah, uh, so I, I, I forced my wife to eat a whole bunch of beans to make her fart in my face. Because I got a fetish. And I love juicy, smelly farts. I love them. And sometimes I shove freaking beans in her queefer and I make her queef because I love the smell of queefs. And queefs are the best thing in the world, even though it doesn't completely work that way. There's a whole, it's, it's complicated, alright? Uh, but all I know, I love making a girl queef. I love it, and then, like as she's queefing, and the uh, and a vulgar release of air comes from out of her, you know what, the JJ, then uh, then I just go down there and smell it before it goes away, because I try everything in my power to make this girl queef, man. And then one time, I went out with a girl when I was like 16. And, and apparently, and apparently, I pulled her pants down, and she was a she-male. And I still remember that day. I don't not like, I do not want to smash she-males. He likes to suck their pee-pees. No. Likes, he likes to get angry from them. I love burping, too. Oh. Uh, Oh, I can't get it out. I'm about to throw up. Are you recording? No. Oh, I thought you was recording. Cause I'm recording too, and I love to record because I'm I'm a, um I I I love uh, you know I'm I'm not Jade because this guy named Jade he's a really cool guy. So make sure you subscribe to his this channel. I meet him. I met him myself, and they uh. Like I'm not Jade, so you like like you ask me. So I met him myself. Just knowing this man, you need to subscribe to this man right here, literally, because this man right there, well no, well somewhere wherever he is, before he gave me his phone and said, hey yo, you can record with it, and I said, hey well the weather's pretty deep going you know bad so let me just start recording a weather video and be a weather broadcaster or something so then but like I'm trying to say go subscribe and get subscribe to this man but just subscribe to the channel if you want me to make more videos I will uh, my name is uh my name is um Jeffrey Jeff. And then this right here, my sidekick, uh, what, 
What's your name? I just met him today. What's your name? My name's my name's Doctor Queef and Quarf. Doctor Queef and oh, I love Queefs. Doctor Queef and Quarf. If you got if you guys want more videos from us and we and if you guys want us to take over the channel, then please smash that like button to death, okay? Because me and Mr. Queef and Quarf, we're gonna make the best video content. For you guys, alright. And also, this goes out to a special person. I would love. This goes out to a special person. Her name is Amber. Shouts out to Amber, all right? I don't know what that, what that is. One crawl on my finger. The freak. Shouts out to Amber. Whatever her last name is, I'm just figuring out about it. Jay told me a lot about what's going on. Told me there was some prick named Messiah and some prick starting stuff for no reason. Oh, just fucking fly, they fucking fly. Oh god. And now, Mr. Queef and Quirf. Is getting captured by a flying ant type thing centipede. It looks like peas, like pea pods. That kind of looks like a nut sack. So, yeah, I don't want y'all seeing my face. This is my first video. If y'all guys seen it, then go ahead. Make sure you tell me in the comments so and let me know not to show my face anymore. But now I'm fixing to record uh, everything else except my face because I love making videos, but I just don't feel comfortable showing my face. So yeah, so let me tell you, I got something. Let me let me send out a message to whoever this kid is that's mm, doing what he's doing mm, is, wait how, how do you spell his name I swear that's like a character in the Bible or something I swear that that's a character in the Bible Messiah that's his name that's a character in the Bible what all right. Well, I guess he's not that heavenly, I guess. But, yeah. You mess with him again. Mr. Jeffrey and Mr. Queef and Quirf are coming to, uh, wait, where? DWN. Oh, uh, you said, you said, you said, you said, uh, you said, you said, you said, you said, you said, you said AWN. No. Oh, oh, oh. T W N. Oh, T W A N. Me and Mr. Queef and Quirf are gonna come, and we're gonna be there. And Je Je and Mr. Queef and Quirf is gonna hit you with the Queef and Quirf. The Queef and Quirf combo. And then I'm gonna hit you with the Jeffrey Star. You, you know my my move is called the Jeffrey Star. Jeffrey Star, all right. That's my wrestling move. I'm just now getting into this wrestling. Jeffrey Star. It, it, that's my that, that's my wrestling moves. Basically, it's basically basically uh. I don't know. It's basically a slam following up with a 450 splash. So it's basically like, I guess I can make my move a combo and say and call it the Jeffree Star combo. And I will hit Messiah and this kid named uh, uh, Jeremiah. Jeremiah 
I don't know, but uh, yeah, I beat the crap out of them. I'm, uh, I'm gonna protect my new friend Jay. I just now met him, but you know, he 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 he's like my new best friend now. So like, yeah. So Jade, you know, kind of replaced, I guess, Messiah, whoever it is, with uh me and Mr. Queef and Quirf. So like, yeah. So that's what's going on right now. And yeah, if you guys want to figure out, I think Mr. Queef and Quirf is working on uh, Stephen, uh, Stephen, a Jeffrey and Queef and Quirf channel. All right, Jeffrey. It's gonna be called Jeff and Quirf, standing for Jeffrey and Queef and Quirf. We're gonna have a channel starting the channel it was kind of Jade's idea we're just taking credit for it psych Jade will get all the credit for it because he's my new best friend and uh and uh he, he called me a, the better best friend to uh beside you know better than Messiah I swear that's a character from the Bible I swear it is it's it's a I swear, Messiah is someone from the Bible. I heard it before. I read the Bible, you know. I read all the freaking thingies, the scriptures, whatever they called, and I'm like, yo, Messiah. Who's Messiah? I want to see who that is. And then I figure out that this guy's name's Messiah. So I'm like, 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 this man is the person from the Bible? No, he seems very unheavenly. I cannot believe this man is actually the Messiah from the Bible. No, it's not. It's not. No, it's not. Well... Why didn't you tell me to in the beginning? But, yeah. I guess it's a different one. Well. And then me and Mr. Queef and Quirf's combo move, or tag move, is called the Jeffrey and Queef. The, the Jeffrey and Queef and Quirf combo. Basically, it's the move that I saw that Jade showed me. The magic killer, I think. Following up with Jade hitting a 450 splash on you. So, like, a magic killer. Oh, no, 450 splash. Me, Mr. Queef and Quirf, and Jade are a new tag team. Alright. Alright, alright. We're ready. Freddy. Like scold cold spaghetti. And we want to go against the Bullet Club, whoever that may be, which... Messiah, Jaden, and a mystery opponent. Oh, so what Jade's telling me right now is it's Messiah, Jaden, and a mystery third member of their choosing? Yeah. All right. Well, that, we got a mystery then. We're going to solve it eventually, figure out who this is by having that match. Who's going to be third member of Bullet Club? Well, yeah, it seems that Bullet Club kind of got, you know, kind of got a little... Oh, yeah. It's pretty obvious that it's got to be Jeremiah. Oh, yeah. Yeah.
Okay. So it seems like Jade is pointing out that Jeremiah might be the third member of the shield. Who's Jeremiah? Oh yeah, you just told me. The one that uh that, you know, attacks you and stabs you with pencils and stuff. Yeah. Now, I know that you don't want nobody to know you're here, but everybody can hear you whispering. Shit. Yeah, I know, right? Like it's like it's pretty weird. Like, you know, you like you, why don't you just talk to your friends? You know, go ahead take take the camera. Take the camera. Take the camera. All right. Mr. uh Queef and Quirf, uh and then or well, I meant sorry, um <laughs> Jeffrey. Uh it's all right. Yeah, it's good. So, yeah, um so I got a new tag team uh and it's called It's going to be called and it's going to be called Undisputed Evolution. So, basically, we're copying off Undisputed Era. We're taking the Undisputed from Undisputed Era and Evolution from Evolution and Undisputed Evolution. Yeah, boy. Yeah, like like Mr. Jeffrey said. Oh, yeah. Um, Mr. Queef, of course, is gone. Where, where did he go? I don't know. He probably done riding his bike down the hill or something. Oh, crap. Well, we need him to make his little announcement if he wants to. But, yeah, what do you got to say to Messiah, Mr. Queef and Quirf? I mean, what? Oh, I, I can't. It's all right. People people mix our names up all the time. All right, so, Mr. Um, Jeffrey. Yeah, Jeffrey. All okay. right. So, you got anything to say? Take, take, take the camera. T take the camera. Don't ask why we're pointing the camera down. We don't want people to see our identity until then. Until we have our match with uh, Bullet Club. Yeah, Bullet Club. Uh, yeah. Sorry, I'm kind of kind of messed up in the head because I had a history of being a wrestler. Uh, been in the business four years and I took many 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 concussions to the head of course so yeah I'm pretty I'm pretty extreme in the ring uh, yeah that's all I gotta say but you know what what well, that's yeah that's really the only reason I got concussions because I'm pretty extreme in the ring all right so you know what? Uh, you know how about I just cover the camera up so we don't you don't have to you don't have to see and get a, have a freaking seizure every time we freaking try to get each other the camera and the light shines on your eyeballs. So let me just uh, cover the lens real quick. All right. Even though you you couldn't even see anyways because it's like eight o'clock right now. So we're at Jade's house. J J Jade's are J Jade's all the way over there. He left. He said he was about. He said he was gonna come back later on. But uh, yeah, I got a little bit too. I got a lot of words to say about this Messiah kid. You don't mess with my boy. He's my boy. All right. He's my best friend. All right. I even though I just met him my best friend and it just so happens that I'm gonna be in the same school same for Mr. Queef and Quirf now obviously that's not his real name but that's his wrestling name it's kind of unusual but he's stupid like that all right so that's what his wrestling name is his real name is unknown right now because he never actually told me he said and i was about to ask him when we started becoming friends i said what's your name and then he automatically just automatically stopped me in my tracks and said 
just call me Queef and Quarf. So I'm like, okay, that's unusual, but all right. So I called him Queef and Quarf. His real name is unknown for real. Nobody knows his real name. Everybody just calls him by Queef and Quarf. And that is his wrestling name as well. So, yeah. So anyways, yeah. Now, obviously, as you can tell, Mr. Queef and Quarf doesn't have an accent, so I have to really actually force him to have an accent like me. So, like, yeah. Because it wouldn't be a good tag team if we didn't have the same accent. Because I'm from the country, he's from somewhere else. And now, Vincent the past is back to Jade, but anyways, y'all guys, tell Messiah to stop messing with Jade, or that Bullet Club versus, um, what, what, what did you call it? Oh yeah, Golden Air. Golden Air. Wait, wasn't it Undisputed? Um, what was it? Evolution? That's what it was called. No, I kind of, I kind of wanted to change it. That kind of sounded stupid. I didn't want to like copy completely. Well, all right, we're the Golden Air. Wait, hold on. Isn't that the name of one of the errors that we had like recently in NXT? Uh, I'm pretty sure, but I don't know. I'm I'm probably I'm probably just gonna stick with that right now until we find an actual custom name. All right. Well, I'm gonna pass this back to Jade real quick. I mean, I, I, well, I, well, Queef and Quarf is not gonna be here, so like. Oh yeah, make sure you cover the lens because their eyeballs are gonna get, you know, kind of messed up by the light. Or, all right. Or ah crap. Okay, so Mr. Uh, Queef and Corf is not going to be able to be talking to y'all guys right now. But y'all guys got a little bit of info on Mr. Um, Mr. Jeffrey. Yeah. And yeah, so that's, that's what's going on right now. So Golden Error versus Bullet Club is put to order. And that's pretty obvious. Jeremiah is going to be the new member, but I don't care at all. And also, Messiah, just for this match, you're rehired. And if you can win, if you can win this match with Bullet Club versus Golden Air, then you get to have your career back. And then you get to have 100% of TWN from me. And then I'll just be a basic old wrestler again. And then, that's it. And then, maybe, hopefully after that, we'll be friends. But that's not going to happen, probably. Because you're going to stay, you, you know, always, you know, start tripping, stay tripping. Am I right? So, like, yeah, that's kind of true. So, like, yeah, so... Yeah, I, yeah, I know. That's that's kind of true. So, yeah, like literally, like he probably just stayed tripping all the time. Well, I don't, I don't say you know call it by tripping. I know you know normally call it like he's going berserk or something. You know, well, yeah, you can put it in that way, but like, yeah, it's just, it's just completely, you know. It's a, it's okay. We can just use berserk, uh, tripping, whatever. But um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll try, try to get y'all guys on the phone. Or try to get y'all guys with Queef and Quarf. Uh, that, that's an odd name. I know, right? Uh, yeah. So that's an odd name. Uh, we need to, you know, we're just gonna like, you know, automatically just peace out. Peace out, man. All right, peace. Peace. Uh, okay, so he's leaving right now. So I don't know what I'm going to do for there. Mr. Creef from the Quirf, I don't know. Who, who knows? God knows who where he is. 
I don't know. So, yeah. So, I got a new catch. You know, I got a new tag team, Golden Error. I'm the leader of it. Challenging the Bullet Club and a mystery third member, Jeremiah, most likely. Uh, so, yeah. All right, I think I'll be able to show my face now, but y'all guys probably won't be able to see it. But, uh, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed this video. Messiah, if you, if Bullet Club accepts, accepts the challenge, then I don't know what to say. But until that match, you're still fired. Um, but then you're going to be rehired as a normal wrestler. And then if you win the match with Bullet Club, then you get your career back. And then you get your spot in TWN back. And Well, actually, this time you get... 100% of TWN, and then I'll just become a basic wrestler along with my tag team. So, yeah. So, you know what? Yeah, that's, that's going to be great. Uh, I hope I get to, uh, you know, get my licks on you, you know. So, pause, though, on that. So, you know, yeah. that would be fun. You know. And also... Mr. Queef and Quirf, and, uh, they're just disguising their names for right now, but you figure out who these people are, actually, they all use their real names, but you figure out who these people are eventually next year. So, Messiah, if you accept the challenge, and I'm actually giving you a privilege to have your friends this time in a tag team, in a three-on-three -three tag team match, just tag team because I want it to be more epic, so it's going to be tag team, uh, you know, more epic hot tags or whatever, so, you know... It'll be more interesting if there's tags. We're gonna just have a traditional no disqualification no disqualification tag match. You don't get to do anything unless you're tagged, okay? So if it starts off a leader versus a leader, me and you, we get to do everything else. But the rest of them, until they get tagged, they don't get to do nothing. Until they get tagged. And that's how the match is going to be. Because I'm making the match. And, well, I own TWN as of now. And I can do whatever I want. So, I'm going to make the match that. And it's not going to be changed. So, you're only going to be rehired as a superstar. But if you win, then you get your career back. You get your spot as commissioner back but this time like a hundred percent and I'm actually being fair here and you and me and you could get something out of this so yeah so hopefully you guys would love that because that is going to be that match is going to be on pay on TWN's first official pay-per-view, World War. So, hopefully, you guys enjoy. Because it's going to be live on this channel. So, hope you guys enjoy. Bullet Club better accept or you're just a whole bunch of pussies. Uh, bye. If you, well, huh. Never. Okay, just bye.